Hey guys, and today we'll be reviewing the this book by this is the breadwinner by Deborah Ellis. So first, when I uh, cover up, uh, what do I mean? So it is the rating, which is four and five. The rating criteria. I'll talk about that later. But first, let's get on with the blog. So life under the Taliban is hard and dangerous. But some children are determined to have a little freedom and to help their families, no matter what the risk. One terrible evening, Taliban soldiers bro break into the family's apartment and arrest Parvana's father without a male escort. Her mother and sisters are forbidden to go outside. Four days later, the food runs out and the family face starvation. Only Parvana can save them, but she will have the courage to become the breadwinner. So this is the blurb. And now the main character, so it is Hossein. He died because of a landmine. Like he was uh, kind of like the brother of Parvana. So now who is Parvana? So Parvana is like the protagonist. So like she used to go to school until the Talib's order. All girls cannot go to school, and she had to become a boy just to like get food for the family. Then after that. Um, Let's come out to the next one, which is mother, which is Fatima. So she used to work for a magazine or radio, but like somewhere like that. So she was like a a writer, but got fired because of the Taliban rule that women cannot go out to work. Then after that we have uh, Nuria, like the sister of Parvana. Then we have Ali, an infant, like he's like about two years old, and Maria, a five-year-old girl. But who never almost go to school, and Mrs. Vera, the PE teacher. So she used to be Parvana's PE teacher, but got fired as the Talibs had ordered women cannot go to work. Now the genre for this it is realistic fiction because this is actually a fiction book. It's not a real based book, but it is inspired by a real based event, which can be that women cannot go to work. So it's inspired by a real based event, and then after that, uh, I would like to talk about the age, which is sixth grade and above. So the reason why this is the age is because age applies here because there is extreme violence and some disturbing events. But if you know anything uh, like about the Taliban ruling Afghanistan, then you can read this book. I would advise you. Then after that we have the rating criteria. So it's four and five is good for kids. This is not, this book is not suitable for kids under the age of nine to read, as it contains mainly some disturbing events. Then after that, let's see action packed because th- this has a lot of a- action. It like the book has extreme adventure, and if you are an adventure lover, then this book is yours. Okay, I'll just give it to you. But uh, don't worry, the where you can buy the book and all that all will be in the description. Then uh, feeling that this may be real is about five on five because while reading the book, the author makes me like engrossed and then we are like in a different environment, like more like this is one environment. Then we when, while reading we go in another environment where the author creates like we are. In the environment of the ruled Afghanistan. So this is my reading uh, criteria. So yes, that's all for today's video. Hope you like it, and the where you can buy the book, it will be in the description. And yes, that's all for today's video, and I'll meet you in the next one. Thank you for watching.